Very, very uh, pleased uh, to be here to thank uh, Director General and all the team that has been working uh, generously with their time, energy, uh, assisting uh, our government, uh, previous government, current government, our officials to uh, uh, prepare the accession to WTO, uh, which is also uh, a very, very important preparation for our uh, ASEAN membership. Previous government, current government, myself, have always considered absolute uh, national priority, national consensus to join WTO and uh, ASEAN. And Director General and the team have been uh, tirelessly, uh, uh, kindly supporting us. And they show patience, which I think they have to have, <laughs> dealing with so many countries. If it were me, I'd probably walk away. <laughs> <laughs> so you require uh, very special people to work in institutions like uh, WTO and uh, others. So I con congratulate. Thank you. And uh, thank you so much, uh, uh, Director General, for your uh, friendship, your solidarity thank you. with, uh, with us, with Timor Leste. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I'm absolutely delighted to welcome His Excellency, uh, Mr. President, who I've known for some years and I'm really, really happy uh, to see him visiting us. We are also very pleased with the way that Timor Leste has been handling the issue of the accession. It's not easy. There are many reforms to be done, a lot of legislation to be passed. And both the previous government and now His Excellency and the present government are quite moving uh, as quickly and expeditiously as they can to try and get things done in preparation also for ASEAN accession. So we are happy to be working with them. We look forward to a successful completion at MC13. We have a couple of steps to still take before then 11 pieces of legislation to be passed. But we know, I know His Excellency from his past will do that expeditiously. So we hope to celebrate in Abu Dhabi at MC13 and then work on the post-accession. So thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.